friend Neek. Hello. And we have to fucking infiltrate and pretend to be a guy. We have a couple things we have to do out here. Hey. And I have a cat here with me. There she is, sleeping. Hippogriff man. Where are we going? Uh, this prime location right here. Okay. And I'm doing a electromagnetic reader. Going, bam. You gotta do it. He he he's got to complete like the story quest fast so that we he can get the car up there. Like it it really felt like a gory Nick's not, but it really feels like I'm I'm like the end is not that far away. You are in the final chapter of a Yakuza game. Let's put it that way. Mm. <laughs> Where the end isn't far away story wise. But it is far away on a human time scale. Wise. Yeah, human time scale. <laughs> <laughs> did I get cancelled? Uh, it did. Dang it! Round two! Bop! I mean, did they explain the fact that this was, like, a shard of the moon? No. Or whatever it was. No, oh, I can't remember, if, can't remember if it's a shard of the moon or if it's just, like, a piece of, of Bahamut's, like, energy when it claps down. Because, uh, uh... Because the whole... I mean, I've told you before about how the whole, like, them, uh them like remaking final fantasy 14 to like not be utter ass is canon to the game world <laughs> yes you have said that yeah oh uh good news ish i believe i have convinced kyle to be more uh liberal with magic items specifically for you as the paladin just because like I was explaining to Kyle how outside of Smite, you do not get stronger until, like, level 11. Yep. And even then, it's it's not a lot stronger. But I was like, uh, yeah, yeah, like... I, I, I don't, I, yeah, I don't, I won't be doing more damage outside of Smite. <laughs> it's like, outside of Smite, Nick's damage is not gonna change until, like... If, if we give him his Paladin thing until, like, level 14. Um, when you get I'll, like, I'll, I'll, I'll get, I'll get Berserker there are for like a lot two of more damage. Well, I mean, you get Berserker, but then you'll get a uh, Divine Berserker, which will be another D6, which will be nice. Um, and I did, I did convince him to uh, do my interpretation, which is probably not the right one, of how um, the thing works, where it just applies a permanent curse. Wait, which one does a permanent curse? Remember, where as long as you're attacking the same target, it's uh, will oh. keep doing the damage. Oh yeah. I have to do like a fucking slash bow or something, right? Oh yeah, I, I should screen share for you. Oh, and also invite me to the party. I should also do that. I'm sure. Screen share. Oh, the report, sir. We have received an anonymous warning that such forces are near. We must redouble our vigilance. I shall recommend that patrols be increased. Oh, so it's got to do like BAM! <laughs> yep, that's how you do it. It's funny because like the story will like... Go between these guys are basically Nazis, so don't feel bad about killing them. And then also, most of these people are just like slave soldiers from nations that were conquered. <laughs> so like, kind of like Star Wars, uh, fall the last Jedi, where the fuck we played. 
Yeah. Or it's like, here's a stormtrooper ready to kill you. You got, you got to kill them all. And then you see like two stormtroopers just sitting talking to each other. It's like, oh man, I can't wait to go home and I can have dinner with my loving wife and kid. It's gonna be so nice. And then you fucking jump up from the ledge you're holding on to, cut the guy in half, and force push his head off the uh, edge. Uh, you know, you know, there's nothing quite like that where like you see him, or or at least too much of it that I remember. There is a point at which uh, you meet a soldier that survived oh, that well. survived the, the ba attack on the base you're about to do, and she gets fucking PTSD just from like looking at you. I was gonna get in the car, so you have to go back in your your things faster than me. Ah, uh, the fucking <laughs> car. It just it just looks so good. This form, I assume. Wait, what? Uh, so I assume it's this. Uh, I'm talking about Sid. And the oh, other guy. Sid. No, okay. I'm talking about. You have the readings. Very good. Here, thank you for fucking reading, Sid. There's four of these crystals should suit our purposes. Though I pray that we won't need their power. My thanks. Yeah. Cool. Hey, Glomit. I forgot what your name, what your voice was, and I, I mean, I'll be honest, I forgot everyone's voices are, and I just kind of uh, guess what I'd give them. Oh, you man, learn the Imperial salute. No, 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 best you don't demonstrate. I'm liable to fly into a rage and crack skulls. I'll take your word for it. Okay. Woo! That's not the fucking pose I. Whatever. Time was I took on every odd job offered to me running messages and calling pesky fun like a good little adventurer. But I'm well past that now. These days, only one thing on my mind. That's what brought me here. Uh, okay. Sark Malark. <laughs> you are a skilled call cast of a pompadour, yes? I've heard of your plan from my friend Glamont. You saw me do this shit, my guy. Here's your friend adventure and son of yours, you both. I'd offer you my assistance. In order to infiltrate Kashram Central, you and your comrades must disguise yourselves as Imperial soldiers. The question is, I go about acquiring uniforms and helms. Uh, kill them. There are places a man might purchase them, but individuals who deal in such wares are not the sort of to whom you would entrust your secrets. It would be more prudent, I believe, to procure what we you need via traditional means from the bodies of their recently deceased owners. A fortified area for a cash from century never lacks for imperial patrols. It's ought not take long to obtain three sets of gear, one for each member of the infiltration he bigs, witch, and yourself. When you have what you need, please return here and allow me to inspect the spoils. Okay, I'm drinking water. I, I don't know, I, I just find it so fucking funny. Like, there's so many things that, like, Wizard is like, this is how you're supposed to run your D&D thing. And then everybody goes, that's fucking dumb. Yeah. I, I, I assumed it was... Yeah, I was right. Okay. Um, you know, they're like, by, by level 11, the, the party of five adventurers should have two magic items of plus one value. Between all of them. Between all of them. And then, mm -hmm. like, every DM goes, Oh, well, I mean, what do the marshals do then? While the wizard says, I have... I have Gwish. Ow. There it is. Uh, it's also funny to me how, like, D&D &D is like, Oh, we, we want... We want, um... We, we want skill. We want bound accuracy for the skill check. So like, I, you know, the, you can't uh, just trivialize difficulty things or whatever. And then it's like, if you really wanted to, like, you could be a level like one party and be able to pretty reliably do like th level like DC thirty skill checks. Because there's so many modifiers you can get at level one for shit, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, Nick, uh, I have been following it on. Maybe you have. Do you know if they've, like, announced that they're, um, a, a planned release date for D&D &D 1? Or what the fuck was? I don't know. I mean, it's been, I, I, I thought it was out. Like, it's been in, like, betas or whatever. It's been in beta, yeah. I don't really care, because I wasn't really planning on playing it. That's fair. Oh, my. That's fine, it's I It's okay. I got you. I got this. There's always that thing of like, hmm. Hey boys. Uh, hello. You're like my dragon. dragon. You see, you can only get the uh, uniforms off the Secutors. You can't get it off the Hapalama Marcus. Okay, well. How is that not an AoE move? Uh oh. Like, you exploded the zone, and it's like, yeah, it's only a single target. Yeah, there is just like just a billion fucking guys uh, watching this fucking gate. Yeah, I mean this is like their like little invasion force. So. I, I will say I am feeling the Yakuza thing of like, run to that area, do a thing, run back. They tell you to go back to that same area to do another thing. Go back. They tell me to run back to that same area a third time to do a thing. I was like, you couldn't have done. You could have told me all these things while I was over here. The first thing. I have to do it all uh, separated. I have to unplug my controller. Mm -hmm. I have to fucking do things with one hand because I have a cat on my other. Larry. Larry is not here. You know who am I? Uh, I thought this was... Nope. I guess it doesn't work here. Oh. Uh, let me see. Trying to remember how to get. Hello, Sarkman Lark. Hmm. What do you have to tame? These are the free equipment. Yes. Hmm. Damage, as I had expected. In the present condition, I fear these uniforms helmets like to draw sufficient. Okay, I can understand, like, the helmets, I punch them kind of hard, but, like, the body armor? It's a fucking suit. I just punch them in the chest. I don't think I punch hard enough for a bit. It must be repaired if only superficially. Also, need blacksmith Egan off at the Diamond Forge and Roy in his house. I should be able to hammer them in shape in no time. I've already sent one ahead and have been assured that he's expecting you. Why not? We've already impressed upon him the need for utmost secrecy as to the nature of your mission. Okay. Mr. Blacksmith, please fix my leather armor. Ah! <laughs> ah, so you're the venture, Sark Malark, shan't I? I've been waiting for you. I'll see what you got for me. Uh, fix this fucking suit vest and this fucking helmet. Please, thank you. I uh, see. Oh, yeah, so I reckon I can have release of this thing for you. After all, I owe your friend Sark Malak a favor or two. Took good care of all we can all back in the days where I found him old Rowena, he did. 
Did you know he's the son of one of the filthiest fatties of Sultanate? it? Would expect someone like that in life you did, but I suppose he always thought the venture left God to him. I I don't I don't care. <laughs> but here you go, blab on a one there's work to be done. Just hold your horse purse for a moment or two. Uh the great you can over have your gear looking good as new. Would you like to hear the my, the, the laugh story of my wife? She she was a great girl. And then we got married. <laughs> And there we have it. We're doing a bunch of good battle by you, but for what it is, how you priority in here? Here's it's like Black like Magadri. Fucking weirdo. Oh, fucking bear. Dude, Nick, I am devastated by the fact that I don't think I I, I don't think I've yet to see another character with a pompadour. Yeah, that's pretty rare. It is devastating that I I don't think I've seen a single character who also has a pompadour. Have you got any uniforms I'm prepared? Yes. You told me your life story for some reason. You should maybe go talk to him about that. Yes, he's also a beautiful. The great eagle of Derefe was impressed. The god is impressed before we even look at us. Thus, the crypt, you should have a joke burning in amongst me forces. As do you fear, the god is my deck of forwardness. Forwardness, in fact, from the greater part of the god invasion was Erosia. You see, when the empire subjugates new territory, it assimilates the people of the land into the armed forces. In turn, these conscripted forces are sent to subjugate faraway lands. In this way, Garland nips rebellion, but expands our one first stroke. Now, Robin, with that, my party mission is done. I'm forgetting I've been messaging your cause. Why would I, a wealthy merchant, wish to help you? I know not where you're such a terrible. Believe me, say, I am but another humble adventurer. What is as only the act best interest of the realm? Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. All classes and jobs, level 46? No, that, that's saying that all classes and jobs can do it. So you have to get the level 46. Okay. I, uh... I'm almost there. I just need to kill, like, a few things. Maybe. I don't know. I was paying that much, much EXP I was getting. We could, we could also do well killing things isn't really gonna get you a lot of xp we Does can do not? a leveling we can uh, do a leveling a roulette what is that uh that's just like we do uh we just do a dungeon we, get, uh, we do a dungeon or 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 we can do the absolute fucking chaos that is frontline uh pvp each either both of those will give you like a full level almost on its own okay. or like half a level oh which would you recommend we do that well, the loving dungeon will maybe be faster. Frontline would be more chaotic and maybe funny, I, I, especially if I don't tell you anything about what's going on. This this, this dude is he is just a guy, Nick. <laughs> yeah. Like that that is, that is his fucking glamour. He is just a guy. Oh, do you have like what? What? What were you saying? Whichever one you want to do, we can do. Just keep in mind, uh, my gear is still uh, le level 40, level 40, 41, 40, 40, 41. Whoa. 16 is my neck. 19 well, is my wrist. What's your highest level? Um, what's what's your highest level? Uh, what do you call it? Uh, Um, dungeon. Uh, duty finder. Uh, level oh, see, you're fine. one. You're like, no dungeons. Uh, let's see. Where the fuck? Anyways, portrait. Uh, 
Ah, yes, the four languages. Jap Japanese, English, Danish, and French. Yes. We. Oui. We. Oui. Uh, how much do you like PvP in MMOs typically? Usually not a lot. Okay, we'll do we'll, we will do a leveling dungeon then. Uh, I switched to, I switched to Paladin, right? Yeah, that way we can. Oh, you you have to register for the duty. You go. Uh, question mark? N no, go to the question mark one. I can select leveling. Oh. oh, apparently I haven't unlocked PvP yet. So. <laughs> well, I'm gonna just hit join and we'll. There we go. I just taxed you into <laughs> instant queue. <laughs> See, the, DPS, the other DPS was like, I have time to go make a sandwich. <laughs> And he only has 45 seconds to get back. See, oh, Nick, fuck, if please, we get Stone should, Vigil... Nick, please pull the glamour... Oh, you got the glamour, are you? Well, I have, I'm paladin. Well, we do the glamour! <laughs> I'm like, still could. I don't think I can change it here, but... No. But I want to see the cutscene of just, like, the, the two fucking Yakuza dudes. It'd be funny. But now, but now you get to see my stupid portrait that I have on this one that you might have seen before. Uh, I don't oh, remember. these guys are sprouts. I think so. Was it with like all the chuckbos or whatever? Uh -oh. Yeah, it's me. See? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I should probably turn on my. I don't have any abilities. <laughs> <laughs> I like, could use like my like my ability to like. Fucking. They're too fast. Buff, 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 buff. Boof! Boof! Should you be getting this many guys? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Fucking a lot different than WoW raids, I guess. WoW raids. It's, it's, all, it's, it's only because it's a low-level dungeon. Okay. Well, like, in like WoW raids, if you try to if you try to grab this many like this many, groups, I might still die. But you would yeah. just get slaughtered. I'm just punching them. Oh, that's a lot of health loss. Alright, my, my cat has locked me into first person. I do not know how to fix it. Oh, no, I, don't, I do not like being locked into first person. I tell you what. Yeah, if we, if we were, um, if we were on, um, in Stone Vigil, I could pull, like, two packs. <laughs> Nick, do, so you, do, you, do, you, do you know the hotkey to get out of fir force first person mode? I didn't know there was a hotkey to get in the first person, so... Uh, how does my cat always find the worst hotkeys? Uh, I don't know. I, 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 pressed, I pressed every key on my keyboard. I, I don't know what she did. Part of, the, part of the thing is that there also isn't too much reason to hold a ton of stuff in, in this dungeon because most classes... Well, they might have changed it, but like before, like most classes didn't even have like their like AoE. Okay, real quick. Uh, Google. Final Fantasy We're gonna have Online because... Forced First Person.
Did someone look at that thing? Nope. Alright, so, uh, the, the first one I saw is people asking, is it even possible to go on a first-person mode in this game? And the comments are, I don't think you can, I don't know why you'd want to. Can so, you not just scroll out? No. I, that was, that was the <laughs> first thing. That was the first thing I tried. <laughs> Help! Uh, if I ever found out someone I was dungeoning with was playing in first person, I would just leave the group. Fair. Fair. I, 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 I can't see AoE moves. Uh, force purse down and see orange. Uh huh. I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, pass on these because they're not worth it for me. Option setting. Uh... You'll, you'll figure it out. Okay, switch to first person when zoomed in is turned off. Well, that means there's like some something else. Uh, key by system. Hog fucking home? Okay. Well. I will admit, I did not hit those keys because those keys never do anything in any game. I mean, to be fair, if you, if you it's not something you normally accidentally hit, so it's probably a good key for such a thing. Yeah, fine, we'll fucking pull these guys too, whatever. You fucking home. I assume you saw what I was seeing, Nick. Like, just yeah. glancing at me. <laughs> oh man, this dungeon. It's the first dungeon that you do, and it's like, mm, we're playing a happy Final Fantasy game, and then it's just like, oh yeah, by the way, this dungeon has sex slaves in it. Oh, by the way, by the way. It's like, uh. Thank you, very good, very good. Like one, like one, like one of the uh, like if you if you have um female care like like player characters like avatars, one of the uh, shouts some of the enemies will do will be will be keep the women alive. It's like, oh, fuck. Wait. I. Uh... I'm a stabbing them, Nick. I'm a bunch of them. The Papa Doll rings true. Is this not a dog? It just doesn't apply a. Does a buff. Man.
It's funny how, like, some of the higher levels are disabled, but not others. What do you mean for, like, your abilities? Yeah. No, any anything that you wouldn't have at level 18 is disabled. Well, with the exception, I think you still get like your uh, class abilities. I'd have to like, yeah. look at. Yeah. Because I'm not your I'm, class I'm ones, almost but, like, certain your, um... I didn't have like arms length or faint. Uh, yeah, cause you, the, 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 the roll ones thing. Okay. Like I have like interject, for instance, which is norm, which is a, and like shirk, which is level 48 one. But those ones generally don't super matter. I mean, they they do, but not in like the same way. Are you are you watching the cutscene? Da 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 da. Why am I doing every once in a while watching cutscenes? Coming! I was watching! Abby! Stabby! We did it. Was that the entirety? Or, or was that yeah. just a boss? Oh, okay. Yeah, the the uh, the other the other two bosses in this dungeon were just like the captain a couple times with the other dudes. Right. And then also the uh, both <laughs> both of them commended me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what up? And then, uh, and then the like the little the dog thing that we had, you had to hit the correct coral for, it, but no one, but no one read the fucking note, so we guessed wrong twice. <laughs> <laughs> there, see, see, you got like almost an entire level out of that. Oh yeah. Like there's so many items that like I don't know what I should do with like any of these. Uh, you get a retainer, which you get problem. You you might not have done a side quest for that yet, and then you uh, uh, not. and then you put them onto your retainer, and your retainer sells them on the market, or Why? you just sell them oh for nothing. God, I really need to fucking just like change the hotkey for that. Because like, I, I have it set up where, like, it'll only... It, the, the record thing will only... The clip thing will only activate if I do, like, Alt-C. Which should be a, something that's very hard for me to accidentally do. But, for whatever reason, fucking page up now. Actually, uh, okay. Alt-Page up now. Can't do Alt-Page up. Shift-Page up! Yeah, Shift-Page up works. But for some reason, like, it will, like, save that I've pressed Alt at one point when I Alt-Tab the game. And I, if I ever press Z, it then starts fucking uh, doing it again. It's really annoying. Okay. Hello, Gramet, I'm back! Good work, yeah, Imperial Dungeon. You be pleased to hear I ain't been idle myself. Took me long enough, but I finally had to plan and get a suit of Magitek armor. Now, from what I've seen, Gash of Sentry deploys a Reaper for most of his patrols. Trouble is, the patrols themselves are irregular, meaning random route and random deployments, and hardly any of them come anywhere near Revenant Stole. Yep. Oh. So open the coax and out of the shells, I took the liberty of feeding him a bit of false intelligence. Told him insurgents had designs on their strong code. I mean, that's not a false intelligence we do. Taint far from the truth. Now I come to think of it. Any row, we should start seeing more patrols than we have up to now. What you need to do is approach one of these patrols, dress up in your shiny tin suit, and alert them to the enemy's presence. I haven't done that. That's what the fuck is my... You want to lure them near, lure them near the Revenant's troll as you can. Like it's not, they'll be wary of entering from their own walls. If they do need a bit of extra encouragement, use this smoke signal here. Flinch fresh from an Imperial Scout. They'll come running. Let's see that, and when the cavalry arrives, you hit them hard and make them off the Reaper. Simple as that. 
If I ain't mistaken, there's a patrol sweeping right now. So run along and don't forget to salute. Hey. I found a book. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Big book. Uh, where are we going? Uh, to the base? To the base, yeah. I want to say there's a... Here, is there a... Oh, like, there's like... Control... Oh, control right click. That, that, you, if you control right click, it'll place a thing. I think it could... On, on if you open up the M map. You can see that? Uh, I cannot see that one. Okay, well... How do I get rid of it? Click on it. Okay. To the right. Up the hill a little bit. To the left. I'm trying to like use use your screen, but it you know the right. half second of a delay yep. makes it hard. Hello, sir. Out of our covert operatives, I take it. In or out of you. Ow. What about in or out of you? Rub you do a do. I remember your courtesies. Uh, if I can slash salute. Slash salute. Ah, very good. You put your hand over your chest. Give me strength. That was your idea. Was so you wave goodbye to the promotion right now. Oh, do you need Imperial Salute? Oh yeah, Imperial Salute. Imperial Salute. What? Well, I'm searching down the knees, you say? Judging by your description, they will be on the perimeter, but I will not have said that I was remiss. You return to the scene and keep an eye on the search. Should not go, or you smoke's gonna call for us. Okay. It's unfortunate that you can't see the ping. Okay, but then it, but it won't let me do it unless I'm in the car with you. Interesting. Oh, I should let you do it. That's it's, I'm really... press I'm pressing it. It's not. Are you doing alt right click? Yeah. And if I get You're... in the car, nope, it's okay to do it. Uh, uh, oh, I, I don't know. Control. Oh, yeah. Okay, control right click is for me, not alt. Oh, control. Oh, I might have just like. Confuse the buttons I was hitting. So you can't see the uh, red flag? I cannot, no. Intr okay. Right, I yeah. know there's a way to link shit. Um... Or is it above? It's above. Hardy. Can do that, I think. I don't think it's anything. Fire the smoke! Or let the fires! Whatever these are. Bang bang. Okay, you know, four levels down. I got this shit. Try good. Fire! Fire everything! Oh, you have to be not in a party, though. Yeah, it's a fucking whatever fight. Ah. I hope you don't mind my joining singles or seizing advanced weaponry. I thought it best to be on hand. Okay. Can you do anything? Ah, there she is. This is the place, but where is the enemy? Sir, over there! Send in the Reaper. Let's make an example of these insurgents. Imagine uh, being in a mech and a guy punches, punches you. you to death. <laughs> like, not you, just he punches the leg of your mech until it stops working. <laughs> Oh, 
Then you watch in like absolute fear as it's like working. <laughs> yeah. I really just see my interrupt. That'd be a smart thing to do. Bah. The magic armor is now overcooked. The fact, that you, the fact that you still have like the world guide I, uh, hot shortcut on your hotbar. I'm lazy as fuck. Like, I don't need like any of these really. Like, most of these on the fucking bottom right. You yeah, haven't even like changed your HUD at all. <laughs> nope. I don't think. Nope. That's like, kind of surprising. I mean, it's like having your HUD in a certain way is like kind of a you know part of it main reason I, I i did i saw like the things in my hotbar so i don't i never i those those buttons are too far away from my left hand to use yeah and you haven't uh and you haven't like changed your hotkeys yet to be able to use them yep you will need to at some point because <sighs> On um, Monk, like, I have like two, more than two full hotbars of uh, icons that oh my God. you have to fit. Oh my god. Fuck, I might, I might, I might need to not be Monk to be more Unga class. Uh, every single class has at least like two. No! Like even Summoner, which is like a super Unga class. My Unga! If you want to, like, I mean, a lot of them are ones you don't use as often. But monks are pretty, I think monks pretty, monks pretty unga as far as, like, DPS goes, I think. Warrior is, like, the unga bunga class, though, because it's, like, you just, like, don't die as long as you hit your buttons. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we, we're gonna fix the thingy, and then we're gonna drive the thingy, and no one's gonna question what happened to the patrol that went missing. That felt unnecessary. I feel like a, a mech probably wouldn't be limping, but what do I know? Uh, what am I doing now? Report to Sid? Okay. Born the Magitek armor, sit in the other shook side. Go on, join him. Sure. Oh, it's a moon cat. We're now at time to take a close look at the Reaper. Our preliminary diagnosis is correct. She's structurally sound, but her server mechanism is faulty. You need to worry though, Big's Wedge will see restored to former glory no time at all. Give us your summon men, and they will think of not else till the job's done. She's a marvelous thing to behold. Prove right, you remind them to visit the privy. So they're just shit themselves? What? 
He said they will think of nothing else but working on the machine. It's great to behold as long as you remember to remind them to go to the bathroom. Is what Sid said. Yeah. So they would just shit themselves if you don't stop them. Yes. That's the implication. <laughs> uh, the players are proceeding apace. Should be long now before Biggs and Wedge complete their work. There is however one small problem. As you may recall, the the, the, machi the machina's probably machina, machina server mechanism was discovered to be faulty. Which subsequently ascertained the Magitech core, which drives its worn beyond use. Such cores are rather fragile devices, uh, which must be replaced at regular intervals. Thanks to negligence or imperial colleagues. However, the one user reaper is long overdue. Um, alas, we do not have access to a ready replacement here in Mordona, but all is not lost. So what things we have identified our alternative, alternative solution? Go and see him, would you? You will explain the details too. Uh, Alright, Sid, I shall go to Bitwedge <laughs> and ask him about the secret thing. I, I will be what, Biggs, tell, Wedge, tell me the secret thing <laughs> that you surely did not overhear us talking about. As I believe the chief has already informed you, the magic tech corner is one beyond use. We need to find a replacement. Uh, I thought about having you appropriate more Reapers, but even if the Dunderhead made his entry as cash of the had to remember to replace the cores, we'd risk arousing Imperial suspicion. But do not despair, for I believe a solution to substitute sub magic core of a mammoth heart. What? In case you don't know, a mammoth heart can be used to grant sentience to an aut automaton. By my reckoning, such a device should be more than capable of regulating the armor's server mechanism, which seeks a minor modification of the housing unit. Why place an order of the first rate mammoth heart with the goldsmith skill? It automates for someone to go to Old and collect it. Oh, and to pay for it. Did I mention how much they cost? No, well, they typically cost something in the order of, um. Who would mind for the bill? It's for good cost. Okay. Okay. I should uh, at least get the quest for it. We're getting Wukong looking ass. To bred me for a fall. The turn of the Superdome Punk brought me was so absolutely astounding. Groundbreaking revolution, he had remained an objective by analysis. As a scholar must. Going over the data, I finally arrived at a starting conclusion. The two of you took measurements of the same area. Values are identical. Equivalence is mocking me as I shall reconcile them. I would not take the same area, though. I could neither sleep <coughs> nor eat, lest I waste time not drawing near the truth. And for what? Tell me, what was the do we do in the field? We fought. No, he didn't. No, he, he's like, he's like, I want this thing, and then I took it first. He went, oh. Bad, now there's bloody chakra dots again. How many times must I tell you it's not but imperceptible ether? Go it what it is. I don't think I'd mind to put your names in mind. My hypothesis was published. This life force, this spirit energy, is a god for sake eternal soul essence. I care not what primitive gnome or those those backward monks which decide. It is ether. Right and simple. They claim they are able to manipulate and amplify through discipline in the opening of the so-called chakra false is nothing more than the ethereal regulation of organisms, a basic and natural concept. And to explain that which science is not even fully sure that monks have erected an institution of control. Their preachings are unassailable by design, for none can disprove the existence of the unknowable. They promise power in return for objection and servitude. Control and power, indeed. Only that of man it is the very essence of a religion, and should be true of a concept of all religions should. 
Ether resides all living things as your natural mechanisms with the capacity to regulate it. The simple life, that's a mystical supernatural endowment. I can say it, of course, the highly mental faculties, faculties of man allow for the potential to gain conscious control of those mechanisms. Indeed, it may appear that you and the summoned monk have achieved that end. The indiscretion and purchase of youth, I suppose it can be forgiven once in my own youth. I was not the moral perfection you see before you. I too have made once of my common mistakes, not myself, but some. In our talks together, the somewhat of monk often spoke of the seventh chakra, that its awakening is ought to be the highest achievement among the monk good. I may have another chance of my intellectual enemies. It was the flow of ether of the two of you which betrayed your falsehood, the whispering of a chakra, as I'm sure the monks would rush to call. But serendipity most often visits the industrious. Just so, as pressing these ether whispers that proved to be the most intriguing. The waves of these sounds resonate perfectly the ether battleground. I can see my vapid expression. that you're missing my point. Allow me to spell it out. It follows that if one were to visit the battlefield of a certain ethereal wave amplitude and frequency, it would resonate with one's own ether. This is the phenomenon responsible for the initial opening of your own chakra. I can't believe I have been reduced to speaking these terms. It stands the reason that if I had an ethereal wave, there may be a location that would resonate with it. Think of the implications. Here, the seventh chakra, the monks speak of truly exists, and so too must an ultimate battleground to bond with it. The concert of ether in such a place would be unlike anything ever recorded. I forgive your past treachery, guide me as it did to the great, uh, guide me as it did to the great discovery. That, and I need to do work for me here, take the new ether ethermometer. Make for Laxico East Child, my research promise you I can need. Hey, Raptor, set up the ethermometer as you have for others in the past, and then kill whatever you must have taken shock reading. Okay. Slaying beasts that will release the ether of the land they are steeped in, and may then resonate for your own, I suppose, in the primitive terms of the monk, and that will translate to expansion of your chakra. Oh, and you will not be causing paths to someone a monk this time. I'll be setting up the next readings in the east end, and don't just allow you two to conspire to be very again. If you care, you <sighs> your worthy friend, some just part of the school. I suggest you may visit the local library. East end, on the other hand, is a fascinating subject, which I know time speaking. Ask me any time you can as a good review. Okay, never. Go away. How's your nightmare, Raptor? My throat hurts. I should stop doing voices that hurt my throat. Doing your monk quest? Yes, because I was here anyway. And it probably would not hurt to have it done. Probably not. Level 45 job one is actually... Not bad, yeah. Um, where do I gotta go? Suit of power. Gotta go over there. Lemur. It could have been better. I'm sorry, Raptor. I hope, your, I hope your day does get better. I cannot go through here. Uh, which means I have to go the long way, I guess, because I can't go through this way. Unless... Uh, wait, hold on. Hold on. Come on. Come on. Let me down there. You bitch of a game. Fuck. Okay, well. Gotta do the long run then. Dude, it, it's so it's so sad looking at like progressions for like the martial classes dick. It's like, ah, oh, fighter! Uh, you hit level 5 and then you get nothing until level 11 where you get a third attack. Ooh. And then you get nothing until level 20 where you get a fourth attack. Ooh. Meanwhile, like spellcasters get at least to pick spells every level, which, you know, that's pretty cool. Yep. They really need like because again like Pathfinder does this right like Pathfinder if you're if you're a fighter you get you get something every level 
Like everyone gets something every level. Like yeah, it's, you get you and in in two in two, in two Wii you get like a class feat every other level, and then you get like a other feat, and then you get a, uh, and you get like a a different feat every level too. And then then that's not even including like the uh, the like just stuff you get for your class. And, you know, a lot of the cl class feats and stuff are just like, oh, you can do, like, a power attack or whatever. But it's still really cool that you that get to pick and, like, uh, build the guy. Yeah. I'm sorry, um, Raptor. I hope, it, I, hope, I hope it does get better for you, though. You shouldn't have to deal with that. The mage shit. Because, like, you know, like, in, in Pathfinder, right? Like, you... you, you a, the, the specializations in Pathfinder for, like, classes, like, they, they have, like, the basic ones that don't change it that much, but, like, each class has, like, two or three specs that just utterly change how the class works. And that's yeah. pretty cool. You know, like you have Alchemist, who's like, he's, they're meant to be this, uh, bomb-throwing guy. Like, they, they just throw bombs. Or you can take the specialization that, like, gives them fucking sneak attack and other rogue shit. And you just become this wizard-rogue hybrid, and it's kinda neat! Yeah. I mean, I'm sure. I'm sure there's plenty of Please stuff don't. that, like, you know, if you were is is not optimal or whatever. But at least it's not like, you know, at least you can feel like you're building someone or whatever, as opposed yeah. to it's like where it's just like you you picked the unoptimal class. <laughs> you know? I just I no matter how whenever I look at fighter like hey I love fighter which like I I do play it sometimes but whenever I look at fighter I just. I, I I can't go over the thought that it just it's a bad class. Yeah. Please leave me alone. No. Okay. And it, like it'd be one thing at least if uh D and D had the fucking feat selection that Pathfinder does. Yeah. I mean, part of the reason they don't is because, like, you know, like, people didn't, you know, like, they were like, oh, there's too many feats in 3.5, so they it, they made it simpler, but there is a middle ground between uh, 2,000 feats and 5. <laughs> there's a middle ground between 2,000 feats, uh, where, where, like, there's 2,000 feats. Where there were three quarter, where three quarters of them are, like, campaign-specific. Or, like, campaign-specific. But, like, they say that. And then, uh, for d d where half the feats are just RP feats. You know? Yeah. Like, half the feats that you can pick in D&D &D are just for, like, role-playing and building your backstory. Very much looking forward to the readings of both you and Winter God's Etherometers. What's this right fish? Then what are you saying there? Go, go give it to me. Here. Amazing. And you're so critical with having the voice, not? I'll begin my analysis. I can see your feeble gear stirring in your mind to come. There's no need to feel shame at your ignorance. If you wish to know what transpired, you'd only ask for some small words. And then, despite all of, like, the, like, again, half of D&D's feats being RP, there's no, like, fun RP feats. Yeah. Like, uh, fucking, one of the feats you can get in Pathfinder is the ability to talk to plants. Is it good? No. But you can talk to plants! Make a make a plant army. I I I think if they made it so that like twenty wasn't the cap for like uh you know attribute increases, then fire wouldn't feel as bad. 
Because the fact that you can be at like 20 strength or dex at level 4 if you want to, you know, makes it uh, a bit unfortunate, like the extra feats. Yeah. A simple monk uh, asked, let us send you his way. Uh, he should see you. He awaits you for you to enter. Oh, help me go and stop the line. Surely you see what I got there. She is the most dangerous type of my one blab ever should revenge. I do wish she'd tell me something. You should live in the future of the past. Yeah, I thought I did not know who he was. Of the other being in resistance. How sad thing. It's not a rare case. Should you tell me something for your own quest? Blah, 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 blah. Why are you my quest giver? I don't like you. No doubt when a god thinks, thinks me the idiot false, these two eyes see far more than you know. I too am an Alamigo and love my home every bit as much as he. Oh no, oh no, hurry, hurry, no Alamigo, I'll keep you no longer. Okay, I, I need to... I, need, I, sh I should be smart and be like... <laughs> First. First. One. Two. Three. Where's four? Uh... There you are. Can I flip this? Why would I be able to flip this? That that would make sense. You are there. At bar nine, you are you are the new one. Change form to Raptor. Can only be executed in Raptor. Okay. Hey, we move! Uh, bind. Hot bar. That's fucking hot bar nine. That should be okay. Drew well, Alamigo! Away! With a new quest for you and me to be Baba to Baba to Baba. Hey, where'd it go? You spoke to Eric. Do not lie to me, brother. You told him who I am, what I seek to do. I am not angered. He tried to sway me from my path. He believes resistance will only leave more dead. I expect as much from him. I feigned understanding. He asked much of me. Of the monk hood the fir and, the, uh, and the fist. He asked me the Samchakra. My answers excited me. He said they had advanced studies. I too learned from him. I am near the Samchakra now. Soon the resistance will rise, you two will see, very soon. Others don't understand. Alamigo tried to protect them. We are the shield of the realm. We bled to find out about. 
But none here know our suffering. None here can imagine the lives we led of the fall after the shield we were sundered. I've traveled far and wide. I've met many souls, but none are as you. You have a gift. Yours is a great strength. United to ours, brother. Help us reclaim our home. Your offer to be rewarded. Look upon my garments. This is the war garb of the monkhood. Now, nah, nah, I'm wearing war garb of the monkhood. It up to wounds of the war, Shaka. It was as opposed to expression. The cause is the beauty of the power of Raglia. Only monks with fists may don it. Only those who will come in trials. I will tell you how it can be yours. Fear not. I require you to speak to vows. I ask where they fight of us. Give us. You give yourself to our cause. You long for adventure, I understand, but such longings can wait. You cannot see all amigo free and enjoy your freedoms. What say you, brother? Give yourself to the cause. Nah. You have the heart of a true monk. You are done brothers in this realm. Hear this. A set of our war was stolen. The fist has tracked the bandits. We know now there are three of the next are. Here in South Thailand, the Sabokja and the Circle of the Tempered. And in North Thailand, the abandoned Magina um, Methromine. Your soul crystal react to Rex. Draw near them, they'll glow. By his power, you can find them. Uh, your fist honor has been trampled upon. Make the heretics you will find pay for the sins. Eric has sold his soul to his land, but he's an honorable man. He knows more than I, the monk, could have fist. Speak of him, you know more than our ways. The man revels in hearing himself speak. I want the dairy fat by his side, brother. Go now, go ahead. Okay. Take me to Paradise City. Wait, are these in the dungeons? Uh... That's not the dungeon. That's just here. Okay, I'll grab that one. I'm really interested in the automatic bonus progression rule in Pathfinder 2e. Because it's like, you know, essentially, because, you know, Pathfinder 2 still is a thing where, you know, like, the game is balanced around you having, like, a plus one weapon and plus one armor, but with automatic bonus progression, you just get that baked into your character instead of having to get it as an item. Yeah. Which is cool. Like, it does have, like... It does make it seem like, you know, spellcasters and, like, alchemists, you know, just from what I've been reading, you know, they don't really benefit from it as much, but also they don't get items that benefit from it anyways. And it's literally just meant to, like, replace those items. Uh. Oh, no, up there. Okay. Hey, are we... are we cool? I'm gonna, I'm gonna just... Yeah. I'm gonna just take this. Fucking... how is that gonna attacking you? I'm gonna just take You're this. level 46. <laughs> Thanks, man! Pe pe right. pe peace, peace between worlds. Bye, man. It's been cool. <laughs> <laughs> I was half expecting to like aggro at the last second, like just turn around and backhand you for half your health. He's only three levels over me. Would have been that bad, I think. Yeah. You're, you're, and, you know, 10 levels over your equipment. <laughs> hey, game, you just, like, let me... Yeah, cool. Ow. Ah, oh, sweet. You know, I've made the mistake I'm making right now. Of like, 
of doing just what? Just running, running through the area and aggroing everything. Oh. Oh, oh shit! Okay. Is he okay? Yeah, she just she jumped down from her tree under my desk and knocked over like half my shit. Oh. Because she wanted to sit in my lap and get pets. Fun fact: in uh, in this game, the uh, the the moon cats, the keepers of the moon, uh, you know, Makote, uh, they're they're matriarchal, and uh, it's something like equivalent of like ten like ten women ten ten women are born for every man, and uh, the way like na 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 maybe not quite that much, but uh, the way that men are na named in their society is just what the the mother's name followed by a number. So if like your mom's name is Sarah, you'd just be like Sarah one. Okay. Then <laughs> like the next son would be Sarah two. Which is really funny. This is bad. Surely this a guy here won't aggro on the next one. Not. If you die, I can come resurrect you. Where the fuck are you? Oh. Please don't oh. also aggro on me. Fuck. I do believe I am dead then. Unless. No. Okay, I will come. Uh, yeah, I will come uh, again. It's it, it just like seven guys who are my level. Yeah. And when my item, when my gear is under leveled by a significant amount. I was like, kind of guess as to roughly where you are. And I went to the wrong one. But I will be there soon. Dust off the old now uh, white mage, I guess, for this one. Was my resurrection as well? Raise the Did I do that for Astrologian too? Yeah. I know, Kitty, but you have a bad ear infection, and like, no matter how much anti bucks I give you, it does not go away. I'll just try to clear out some of the gunk out of your zone. You know, there's just there's just so many guys here that it, uh, if I had, like proper gear, I'd probably be fine. But yeah, I'll uh, I will protect you. Okay, time to time to go to the last one. It's a preacher. God damn it. Leave my body alone. <laughs> Fucking Zert. Zert. I wish there was more I could do for her, but she she has these like giant cysts in her ears that uh -huh. like stop the antibiotics from like working properly. And the only option to fix that would be doing surgery for her. And I'm not crazy about taking my 18 year old cat who's already having issues in it for surgery. Yeah. Dude, is that like what the vet said? Yeah. Where like they take surgery at this yeah, point? Yeah. 
Uh, is there any chance of them just kind of eventually going away on their own, or? She's had this ear infection for like two years, so. Ah. Uh, is it affecting her hearing? I don't think so. You know, by like she responds to me as much as you know any cat really would. Okay. When I get home, she'll usually hear me coming up the stairs and start meowing. Okay. And I think there's only one ear, not both. It's these guys shouldn't anger on you, because they are yeah. low level. These guys shouldn't argue on to their low level. Let me blow them up. Yep. Wow, it's like I want to bully them. Turn the first two acts of yours, and now the fist is located in the fourth. There is, there is a queer gun merchant who deals with contraband. The fourth one is among his wares. Hurry to Lord Nos Noskia. Find this queer gun, then take it back, which is now yours by right. Oh, kitty, you, you lay down. You don't normally lay down my lap. You just stand on my lap, getting pets. And I have to do a bit before I'm able to fly, right? Yeah, yeah I think. Well, I think you once you complete the main um, story is when you get to fly. So. Which which uh which tracks with um, in later in later uh expansions where like flying was there originally you don't really get to fly in a zone until you beat the story for that zone what are you looking for nothing i'm, I'm just i'm just by my cat ah. well, the, when she lays on me like this i try to get what like gunk out of here that i can ah do you use like a q-tip or whatever uh, no. Uh, you just, like, finger? Just, yeah, I figure just rub it out. Thank you, Roger. Come stop Kinkron's business. Come to the shiny skill. Go sneaky. Wow, fucking spin kick. <laughs> oh, da 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 da. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. I will I I will heal you as the tank. Okay. He aggroed onto me because I healed you so much. Kitty, your back legs are bad. Just lay down somewhere, please. Good kill.
I assume you're eventually going to make your way back to Mordona. Eventually. The fourth relic is, your, is now yours. You have done well, brother. But know this. this there's another relic. A fifth. A battle piece. It'll be yours. A gift from brother, brother. Give it on the day Alamigo sends you once, once more. The day, the day is near. Alex went to war not long ago. He claims the revolution has begun, as well as made a grand discovery. It's now sending in paper. I look forward to his work. With it, we will know he must. The day he finishes will be the day Alamigo is reborn. Return to him now, brother. Ask for yourself what it will be. May Raga watch over you. Okay. Nick, you should quickly look on the stream and look at what my how my cat is sitting right now. Is like what I have to deal with her most of the time. <laughs> See how long it takes to reach you by. I'm afraid I have a time for you now, Cass. I'm painting my thesis based on Ethereum data you and your subaltern collected. There have been significant developments since we last spoke, or rather, since the last I spoke, and you to be me with that ever vapid expression. Soon I'll complete my work and present at conference of my peers. Surely you can pass time until then, punching and kicking and pursuing other monthly interests, yes? Go on, do that. Okay. Your green screen is unaligned. I know. But cat, <laughs> so can't fix it. Yeah, but I mean, like, she she's using her back legs to push up off my legs and just smushing her face into my arm. Yeah. Hello there, come to collect a mammoth heart. You say? Then you must be arguing about the god and I works. I'm taking liberty of picking the finest example we have. A heart fit for a prince amongst mammoths. Payment will not be necessary. The heart's for Master Alphanod's personal use, after all. You notified us a short while ago that his mancer would become a collector. Tender in years though he may be, Master Alphanod has been a better benefactor for ours since my predecessor's time. It goes with the good one G with charging him. But here's the Mammoth Heart. May I serve you well? Oh, please do pass him across your master. Okay. I'm never going to know if you're pronouncing it that way on purpose or just because you don't care. Combination <laughs> of both. He's just here purring very loudly. Wanna go in? How is it have you seen? Okay. I have the heart! Here the mammoth hut. I can't really see if it works. Here. I'm sure turning the war out of automaton sentient's not going to be a bad idea. This is magnificent. Must have cost an emperor's ransom. Oh, I've not paid it. Free of charge, courtesy of Alphanod, coming with influential fantasy. Family certainly has its advantages. You have all these fucking knots on you, kitty. You don't, you don't let me brush you. About further that's, through. That's the thing with my cat, too. Like, well, it does what she wants to let you brush her, but she's... You brush her, and then just the next day the knots are back, and it's like, okay, <laughs> well. Uh, She's a short hair. She's just, like, mangy. <laughs> Hello. For some reason, I'm not liking Final Fantasy XIV. Due to the complicated job system unlocking after finishing up Kodra at level 30, didn't get White Mage, I had done my research, I, I have to do more MSQ in order to get the next job quest. Are, are you asking me what to do? Wait, what? Uh, someone in chat. Because I'm just playing Monk to Unga. Nick, my friend, the guy in here, is the one who 
fucking notion about Final Fantasy. Yeah, what was the, I... What was uh, the question the, the about message, Light Mage? The, the message he said is, Hello, for some reason, I am not liking Final Fantasy XIV due to the complicated job system. Unlocking after finishing up Conjure at level 30 and didn't get any... Didn't get White Mage and I had done my research. I have to do more MSQ in order to get the next job quest. And I, I, I don't know what to do with that information. Oh. I mean, assuming, I mean, no, assuming oh, he's just it's complaining. not just like... Okay. He's just complaining. Oh, okay. He's just complaining. Oh, oh okay. He, can't, he comes in here to complain. How you doing? I'll be buying two. We got suits ready. Got it. First, I'd like I think, you to yeah, try... I think, I think, I think, I think, that's a, I think that's a common thing where it's like... Because especially on like new servers where you have the XP progression, it's really easy to like get to level 30 before we, while, while doing just other stuff. Uh, but you don't get... Um, you can't unlock your your job stone until you complete self-management which is like part of the main story quest okay pilot the magic tech chris to the crystal mount okay donk donk jazz if you were to lay down on me instead of just standing there you'd be a lot more comfortable you know that yes so me up other crystal mount or what's the thing it's self-management i don't know i, I only a bit know because i've read other people talking about it it's been like long enough that now <laughs> uh currently uh brock we are or at least i am i'm trying to get the main quest done of the first of the main game so that i can grind the shit out of golden spatula fucking whatever it is so that um i can buy dakar yeah, you have, yeah, you have to complete the rest of the main story quest, and also do the quests for the uh, event, which won't take that long, to be fair. I don't know what was evident from it. Like, good. Next, jump back down and then spit north quick as you can. Okay. Wee. The car. The car. Square doesn't even tell you when you can unlock White Mage. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I have only done pugilist because I wanted to punch and complete the my uh my yakuza shtick. I am a yakuza grunt. Like doing some dropping on pack of fans and exit. Please make your way back. Okay. Uh, the the look is very good in the car. That as soon as I'm allowed off, I can show you. <laughs> this isn't obnoxious or anything. But also being stable during vigorous motion. Excellent. And I can lose test. Thank you. Yeah. I wish I show him, Nick. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> The fucking boys. <laughs> Just two goons out for a drive. It's so dumb. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> Here's a summary of my findings. Uh, the drivetrain... Fucking all this goddamn cat uh, hair. Here's a summary of my findings. The drivetrain is in sound condition. With some fine-tuning, we expect a notice of improved performance as for certain mechanism. I'm afraid it's not nearly as responsible as it should be. I'm at a loss to explain why. The Mammoth Heart is in pristine condition and should be installed correctly. Perhaps inner workings are simply too different to operate harmoniously with the armor's other mechanisms. Whereas Magic Tech Core so only can to conduct impulses, Mammoth Hearts enable Automata to process information collected by the sensors as feeling. <gasps> Feelings! Maybe she just doesn't feel like part of the team. In which case, we should do our best to make her feel welcome. <laughs> I stare down at the engineer. Who is telling me to welcome our fucking mech into our group so that it will work correctly? They have like some form of rudimentary like AI or sentience. Hey, buddy, welcome to the gang. Well, okay. 
I can't wait to fight the Emperor or whatever it is, like the final quest or uh, Ultima, and then get my big brother to go one shot him. Ah! Draft isn't felt. I gave the best I've got. Oh, oh, fuck. Shit. Ah! Brush the kitty. No doubt you're wondering why the sort of mechanism is pointed as to warrant this silliness. Oh my god, kitty, you're not. Without it, the pilot would be required to con uh, control the armors and remove them manually. This would be an onerous task at times and wholly impacted dur during battle. Kitty, could you not step on my ke keyboard again? You already forced me to. That screenshot failed. Using a mammoth hard to place on the War Magister core seems a promising solution. Alas, the device does not appear to be compatible with uh, Galian technology. Unfortunate. Wedge, are there no other ways we might demonstrate appreciation to our friend here? Ah, yes, that's the that's the issue. But my what's end, Chief? She just doesn't seem convinced. We could try a little dance, perhaps, or cheer our heads off. Fucking Warhammer ass mechanicus. The the armor the the, the mech suit is not working. What can we do? Uh, dance. Pray to the machine. There's the Reaper. Sid. Nope. 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 Taken by the traitor, Gallon. And is that the Acon Slayer? Oh, bollocks. Go for reinforcements. The hells you will. I'm Tech Priest Sid. I have a bomb in place. For just such an occasion. Uh, sir, uh, there's a signal interferer. He pushed a button over there. But maybe that was an interference device. Oh my, I forgot we're climbing. Destroy it. Uh, you see, when they were talking about seeing a magic suit, I thought we were seeing like one of those things. Those things are way cooler. Yeah. And now the magic suit's gonna be like, oh, they protected me. I'm gonna work now. I can bleed. Alright, Wedge, you've already named it Maggie. I'm sure that won't be a problem. Uh, either of you two want to fight? You just gonna you just sit there and watch? Nah, that's, that's good. No set up. I don't know, he has that kind of dagger. I'm him at first. No, you just, you just stab him with his, like, wrench. They protected me. They're from. No, never mind. Hey, it's me. Chief, Chief, look, she moved. Ah, now she deigns a grace us with the presence. Took us a good while, but we're finally ready. It's time to infiltrate Castle Shenzhen and rescue our comrades. 
Yeah. There, the finishing touch. I feel like spray painting the the logo of like a, a known group against the Empire is probably not the greatest plan on our infiltration uh, right probably not The servo mechanism is now fully functional, and all it took was a simple fight to the death. Reminded me not to install Mammoth Heart aboard the Enterprise, would you? Much I love her, I'd rather not be required to profess it before boarding, but enough of that, let's see our final preparations. Thanks, Briggs and Wedge, you're as good as new. Worst prayers I'd like to get. Outgoing preparations, we'll leave as soon as you're ready. Yay! Yeah. Gulama, you came. I thought I'd give you all a roar and send off. Tis the least I can do for the five men and women who are about to make my lifelong wish come true. Lifelong wish? You've been fighting them for like uh, ten years, maybe. Ah, I don't know the timeline is. Well, we'll do our best. Curse me for all the help you've afforded us. We know a little less about you. What did the Empire do to earn your ire? Ah, uh, but I fear I put a curiosity over my consideration. Quite a sight, I'd rather not relive those memories. Oh, no, I don't mind, really. Truth be told, part of me was itching to tell you my tale. Mind you, tis hardly novel. I ain't the first to suffer imperial ends. Like most folk, I used to have a mother. She was a sweet, caring, most. Like most. She was a sweet, caring woman with a smile never far from her face. I was a sister to a pretty little thing. She was gentle as a lamb, tough as nails. We were poor folk living simple lives, and we knew happiness just the same. That's our hope. And then the Imperials came to and took it all away. When Ali Migo fell, they put my family in a camp. Being a lion, I was made to do hard labor. While well, my mother and sister were forced to do far worse. They had to suffer for me as best they could, but I knew the thought of it drove me mad. We yes. had we had to escape, and so I hatched a plan to get us out of the city. We were picking our way around a gorge not far outside the walls when they caught up with us. And rather than allow themselves to take it again, my mother and sister leaped over the edge before my very eyes. Heartbroken as I was, I had to put up a fight. The parents clapped me in chains and dragged me back. Was well, some years after that, that I escaped again, and that time I got away. I swore then I get revenge of the Empire, and because of adventure, so as the home of my skills earn the coin I needed. But I on two decades of sense be gone by. What have I achieved? Bugger all, that's what. Not like you, lie. You ain't been there ten minutes, and you already done more than I managed in ten bloody years. You give us too much credit, Gallimut. We seek only rescue our friends. Well, what's more important than that? And any road after yeah, you got uh, your I'll friends. Oh, art comes later. <laughs> uh, back, you got planning going out of the Empire. Don't pretend you ain't. I've helped a few folks take on POs over the years, and every time I have, it's helped save off my type of revenge. But someone tells me. I'll be going hungry for a while with everything you've got planned. And you're sure that will satisfy you? wish to strike back to the Empire of your own hands. You can only say the word. We'd be glad to have you with us. Tempting though your offer is, I'm afeard I must decline. I swore I get revenge of the Empire, tis true, but I've long since realized the front lines are no place for men like me. I, or some as would call me Craven, but I prefer to think of myself as a realist. My town science scheming, you see. Not swordplay. Help folk like you is how I can make the most difference. Nick, have you watched the uh, the Space King uh, animation? I don't think so, no. That's quite enough story time for one day. Best not keep your friends waiting any longer. I'll be praying for your safety and success. It's, the Flash gets made like an 18 minute uh, Warhammer animation. Just, you know, ma you know, making fun of the Warhammer universe. Uh, for the sake of all cars are home, we must put it into Gaius' uh, ambition. It's, it's kind of entertaining, because, like, yeah, that is kind of just how Warhammer is. Briggs, Wedge, and I will line away east of Castle Sentry, just outside of the Stronghold Patrol Perimeter. Join us when you're ready. Oh, and don't forget where your disguise would be a choice race of mission history. 
Can I wear my glamour over my disguise? Do I have the disguise gear? Uh, it'll be in your um, armory chest shift eye. No. Control eye? Control eye. Yes. Equip. Glamour. Fuck. There we are, Nick. Disguised. Because I'm, I'm pretty sure I only have, like, body and head. I don't think I have legs. Okay, hey, could you guys, like, not fight me while I'm wearing, uh, level 1 gear? That'd be cool. Saying, so we cut quiet, Ashen figure, Imperial Black and Crimson. It's it flashes to me in my blue and pink. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Even my face is like, are you okay? <laughs> Let's review the infiltration plan. Council of Chachi lies just beyond. Short while ago, Imperial Patrol left to do its rounds. Alpha Nod and I will create a diversion out here and keep them occupied for as long as you're able to. Meanwhile, the three of you under the stronghold pose a patrol returning from duty. Should Alpha Nod and I approve less checking the nope, I will contact you via Link Pearl. Be ready, bear has to retreat. Wow. Wedge will lead the way in the Reaper. Stay close to him. And I only tell you this, but don't do anything suspicious. I'm sure they won't question the fucking uh, group marking. Oh, unless you wonder, Eda and Yashola left shortly before you arrived. We had planned that they should link in the vicinity to cover a tree in the event that Alphanon and I attracted too much attention, but the approach of an Imperial vehicle forced us to improvise. Don't be too disappointed, they did at least have a message for you. Something along the lines of don't do anything reckless, memory serves wise words. All right, Imperial Trolls should be returning any moment now. You must be off. Good luck. Bad to have to keep you. <laughs> the fucking cutscenes with my character, though, Nick. He ruins yeah, them all. <laughs> Ugh. 
You have spirit. That mm. I will allow. Yet you struggle Let's see if he's down. Yeah, I don't really care. Um, I didn't mean to get that one. This echo of yours intrigues us. We desire only to understand it. And for that, we need your help. You wish to be rid of the icons, do you not? You would have saved yourself a great deal of torment. Had you accepted our aid from the beginning? I imagine her outfit must be like really uncomfortable to breathe in with like Tell me everything. I'm pretty sure she's in like a skin tight like everything. With like a hole somewhere on there for air to get in. I talk about the, her outfit. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't see any, like, gaps to allow air in. It's magic. Be so kind as to deliver the prisoners to Castrum Meridianum. Yes, me lady. Me lady. That was very nice of you to wait to start screaming until they were done talking. Perform an Imperial salute to the Imperial soldiers. Got it. You, Imperial courier, I, I am good guy. Imperial salute. Yeah. Oh, my pleasure. I know you there. So gross was I my task. You're being gross too. I have the Trumpinus command you to range the prison for transporter. What person I speak of? Oh, you mean you haven't heard? Only the infamous signs of some dawn. They have this, like, crazy, uh, sign. It's on that fucking mech you wrote it on here, too. It's weird. Uh, Captain Blood Tribunus yourself. If that you don't believe, have a look at the sword shower we're next passing away. You hear him screaming and complaining and dying and... But... Mario de Kern. That's a friend, sir. Duke, the main school by Akkadens. Are you welcome to the Kashim Century, engineer? What prisoners? Are oh, you heard the rumors? Then yes, the being out of the sword shop. I strongly suggest you pay them no mind. You are summoned here to work, not to gop it, or is his defeated heroes. Now show a bit of enthusiasm, I reported. Dude, this guy is just fucking sleeping with his like sergeants over there. <laughs> he 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 found their blind spot. Don't snitch on them. Haven't you visit the storage tower recently? Have you? I only ask because I I dropped something in there and uh. Oh, who am I fooling? I've fallen for one of the prisoners. All right, I dare say. I, the, the, the Svelte Lawn? Goodness, no. It's the, Le, the Lefellian last I've spent with. She's so adorable and hurts. I want to sweep her up into my arms and squeeze her my arms ache. What do you reckon a dude take me to convince the steer to lend me the key so I could see her? Oh, I go back to sleep now. I walk up to this man and I look him in the eyes and I go, Imperial salute. Fuck! And then I actually salute. <laughs> What's this? You actually sword star? What business have you there? Ah, uh, the tribunus of behest, you say. That is high energy record, but it'd be not due to do back my lady worth. Thank my dedication, Keith Caesar. We don't even concluded. Look at oh, oh my oh my boss wants you to offer a secure area. Alright, here, take my key. <laughs> Nick, no, no Nick, further questions. Nick, I know for a fact you have probably heard of something like that in your line of work. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> yeah. Very sad, just to expect it. We're going to need a special key if we get one across the bookend. I have a special key.
affable Imperial. Phil and the rest, thank goodness they're safe. I'm the one you want to leave the others be. You are my friend, I swear, I should take my own life, and she never and she should answer to your mistress. Taru, we must do something. We're using the cash room and Tigers are over here. That's the plan. Uh, you're right. We may not get a better chance. This is the third squadron. What is it? A Reaper seized wet. And this came to light only now. I know, right? You guys are really bad at your jobs. The culprits have left the trail. Takes many minutes you need to scour the area. I want that Reaper found. That's a chance. Oh! Ah! The Reaper! I found it. What the? Strike my last. Eliminate the intruders. Man, that guy who just gave me the, the key is gonna feel like a real jackass when uh when the video comes up and he's like, hey, hey, I need some answers. <laughs> I need a lot of answers. Anytime you guys want to help, that'd be cool. Ow, my health. God, the AoE attacks do so little damage where just the single damage. Yeah, they, well, in general, AoE attacks become more efficient against three or more months, uh, the targets. If you're doing two or less, it's best just to do a single target. I'm sure there's, like, I'm pretty sure there's, like, exceptions. Like, I want to say, like, the healer AoEs are better against two or more, and, like, there's probably other things going on. You get into the weeds, but in Are general, you fucking died, Wedge. You suck. Are you just like protect him? Apparently, he died. <laughs> like both the guys, like the last two guys, had like less than like ten percent of left, and he fucking died. What a loser. Oh, your fucking shift bar is on the left. That's fucking weird. <laughs> what the fuck do you mean? Well, like, just the fact that you have it on the left instead of, like, with all your other abilities. Does it matter? <laughs> I mean, it, I mean, it just tripped me up. It doesn't really matter as far as, like, using them goes, but... Oh, like, what, uh, level 90, you're just gonna have like three different bars, and like one of them's gonna be just a square in the middle of your screen. Maybe. What do I do? And you're gonna die to a lot of AoEs, the lack of being able to see.
was so scared. Bleh. It was foolish of you to come here. You might have been killed. But thank you. I should think what might have happened had you not arrived when you did. I say, did you not see Thank Grenade? Well, we get a feel for the fellow. Nah, I didn't see him. You linger here, so you just no answers. So let us away. Out the window, try liberty, close shut. Oh. What did you say? Escape, then recapture them. Fail, and I shall have your head. And what have we here? Hello! The Tribunus herself, just as you said, you have the eyes of an Armin, Ida. Oh, she's got a hard to miss in that show, armor first. It'd be so funny if they killed her, though. Accursed scions, how did you slip out of fences? What expected ease, if truth be told, there chance to be a commotion outside the Kashim's walls, or does avail ourselves of the comforts of your vehicle. Ishtola's just being polite. That was one of the most uncomfortable things I've ever shown away in. No, it's no wonder it's called the Phantom Train. No passenger would ever be seen dead in it. And if only these two were to accomplish anything besides just getting ca uh, captured, make it harder for me. So you scatter amidst the freight like the vermin you are. I should be sure to have work of it. That is far from your most pressing concern. First, you must answer for your own wrongdoing, Livia San Ju Junius. Stick! Fist! Twas you who led the raid on the Waking Sands. You who butchered unarmed men and women for the crime of being unworthy of your capture. You killed our friends. I'll never forgive you. Nor shall we suffer you to plague Eorzea a day longer. Be take you to your guard. Oh, truth, break the tribunus. Man, well, you guys have, like, attacked her instead of fucking monologuing. <laughs> Gun fist beats a regular fist. Who would have guessed? Where is his, is his excellency? In there, my lady. In discussion with our guest. Alert him at once. Yes, my lady. Punch? No, 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 no! There they are, fed out and surround them! Must protect Tataru. Biggs, I'm going in, see everyone to safety. Dude, your mech sucks. No, Wedge, don't do it! Wow, well, okay. Like, he simped so hard, he sacrificed himself. <laughs> For no reason, too. Yep. Mush. Wait. Okay, I don't know why my ability is not casting that push the button. I don't know why it is not putting me into my other stance. Okay, that was weird. Okay, this is... Okay, I can't hurt that guy? I... I can't hurt the, uh... Oh, there's some sort of thing you're supposed to do or wait for first. Um, no, at least I. Oh, 
He is invulnerable. Um. Did I just leave? No. Okay, I'll just fight the other guys, I guess. I'll break the generator? I think that'll do it. Okay, yeah, okay, now I can hurt it, because I broke the shield or something. Yeah. the fucking generators wherever they are. Oh, no. I can't. I can't. I arbitrarily can't go that way. They must be somewhere back here. Ah, there they are. Can I know? Could you have not broken that one, my guy? Goodbye, Colossus. It's been real. Man, it's almost like we could have just fought our way in here in the first place.
Man, we suck. A little bit. Take the leader. Kill the rest. What the? The Astola. Pray, forgive us our delay. Man, she, she... Punch. <laughs> Papalino, Minfilia. Ida! What took you so long? Well, it's nice to see you too. It's very nice of like the, the other soldiers kind of just like let us have the conversation. The reunion must wait. Right. First things first. Yes, let's get back to being heavily outnumbered. <laughs> you ditched your Magitek armor. Fool of a Lalafell. Well, excuse me. It is all yours if you think you can do any better. What are we talking about five? Like one Mississippi or what are we talking? One. Two. That is slow counting. Three. Four. It was very nice of them, Nick, to let uh, that prisoner keep his monocle. Yeah. That was very nice of them. Which is more pitiful, the charlatans who um, I'm I'm angry. I'm, I'm, the I'm so angry. This cutscene is voiced. <laughs> I see that which they cannot. This realm founders for want of a ruler with true power, the power to cast down icons. If you continue to deny this truth, it is the people who will suffer. Embrace reason. <sighs> what in the seven hells? That was good reaction time. It's here. Twelve preserve us. They finished it. Ultima weapon. So it has a name. It is a relic of ancient Alag, excavated from its resting place deep beneath Alamigo. The Alagans used it to crush primal and foe alike. And now the Galians mean to do the same. Damn you, Gaius! Look! There! Beside the Black Wolf! An Asian! An Overlord, no less! His garb attests to that! La Habrea! It could only be him! Was La Habrea 
No. No, this cannot be. This voice acting, Nick, is so good. <laughs> it, Sacred! It, it, it improves no! a lot. It improves a lot in Heaven's Word. But yes, the you know, Realm Reborn voice acting is markedly not the not as good. <laughs> All that time, the enemy was beside me, and I never even suspected. And to think that it was I who suggested that Thancred investigate the Asians. <sighs> How could I have been so blind? Small wonder the enemy knew our every move and where to find us. <sighs> Confound it all! <sighs> no. No, this is not the time for self doubt. The Alliance leaders stake their hopes on the Scions. But now they believe us all dead or missing. When they learn of the Empire's new weapon, we cannot be certain what they will do. We must go and offer them what assurances we can that defeat is not inevitable. Cryo? This is Minfilia. The situation I may have taken an ill turn. Forgive me if I seem brusque. But the battle is far from over, and so long as we stand together, there shall ever be hope of victory. The people of Eorzea falter for want of such hope. Let us provide it. Let us bear to them the tidings that the Scions of the Seventh Dawn are returned. Matters are coming to a head. I hope we can count on you. My regards to Grandfather. I am ready. Let us pay a visit to the Council of the Alliance leadership. Chaos the Black Wolf and his new toy. Ready, all available forces. Aren't them ready? Move upon my word. Every day to say Celeste for the order sale. That's all. The Maelstrom sounds ready. What are the flames? Ready as you like to be. They only give the word to Roel. You are tiny. Has there been no word from Ishgard? None. The dragons have got their tongues. Silent to the last, I was unwise to hope for better. What would still the Archbishop open his holy mouth? Not this. And he claims the fury for his god. Tis bad comedy. The Holy See has made its choice to proceed without its cooperation. I believe we're all kind of the terms the Black Wolf's ultimatum. Must agree upon a course of action, not unless the fate of it your hangs by the decision of this council. Bam, Bellasar claims we have the power to smite primals. Should we yield to him, he pledges to rid the realm of its false gods, yet offer resistance, and he swears that we shall spare, share the primals' fate. 
Pardon me, my bluntness, but I'd like not these choices. That this is too great for any one of our nations to make alone. Choose we surrender resistance, we must answer as one. For if but one surrenders, the rest shall surely fall. Let us pray for the wisdom to write by all our peoples. Aye. Thinker's plight troubles us all, yet we cannot allow anything to come between us and our goal. So long as the Ultra Warp exists, Aorza will never know peace. Let us go to the last leaders and help them make the right decision. Okay. Grim tidings. It seems that word of the Ultima Weapon's existence has already reached the Alliance leaders. In the form of an ultimatum, they have gathered in the fragrant chamber, delivering their answer even to speak. Beleaguered as they are, I fear they may well like to lay down their arms in the belief that surrender will spare the people under suffering. Yet nothing can be further from the truth. That which the Black Wolf offers will do Maorizia, not deliver it, and the leaders must be made aware of this. Let us hear to them. And sure they do not make act you know the consequences. Okay. Excuse me, let me fuck it out. I hate navigating this place. The Council of the Alliance leaders presently progress. In the fragrant chamber, I must ask you to wait for, for the door, sirs. I'm sorry, on behalf of the science of the seventh dawn? A thousand pardons, my lord. Of course you may enter. Learn the people you talk to. Ah, we keep treading the same ground. Van Belsar's demands are clear. Alas, our minds are not. I've never been one to shy from a fight, but if this weapon of theirs can do all they claim... It has been five years since the Calamity, and our people have scarce begun to rebuild their lives. Can we now, in good conscience, call upon them to risk what little they have left? I would spare them the pain of further conflict. Conflict, I say, though that would imply forces set in opposition. If the combined might of three primals could not stay Garlemald's new terror... It can fucking stay you. <laughs> I know, right? What can we offer? <laughs> we who struggle to quell the foes who rise up within our own borders. Long have we fought the primals, but to what end? We strike them down at no small cost, only for them to rise again and again. Are we to play this profitless game for the rest of days? I, for one, grow tired of it. Mistake me not. I do not propose to trade one tyranny for another. I love liberty. But conciliation need not mean oppression. By the Twelve, though neither of you cried surrender, your every word betokened it. <sighs> mm. 
Not that I deny there is truth in what you say. Nor can I rightly claim that Uda is ready to fight. Go down! Chase flood our gates, and beastmen swarm our land, while the great and the good do nothing. My flames struggle to bear the burden. I put on a grand show at the remembrance service, made all manner of lofty promises. I've made good on not a bloody one. Do not blame yourself, Raoban. You said only that which the people needed to hear. All present have done the same. Our citizens had become lost to hope. If our words serve to kindle it in them anew, better we speak than remain silent. Our enemy condemns us for failing our people. Yet what does he care for their well-being? While we labored to rebuild their lives, the Black Wolf built instruments of murder. With of which murder! To them. Her Majesty speaks true. For all our failings, the people's well being has ever been our foremost priority. While none among us ever doubted that the Empire would one day resume its war. We scarcely had means enough to solve the problems of the present. Aye, which is why we look to others to safeguard our future. The Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Alas, they are gone, and the Black Wolf is at our door. Admiral! I fear you are mistaken! Alfinord, Minfilia, and Seven Hells, Master Garland? Fucking endlessly hilarious to me how they, like, <laughs> did not have them correctly pronounce his name. <laughs> like, Alfinod? By Ralga, you're alive. All of you. As we approached, I would swear I heard talk of surrender. But I know that cannot be. It is not the Eorzean way. Hear me, my friends. Accepting the Gallians' offer to vanquish the Primals would be folly. Folly, I say. For might is not the answer to the Primal threat. Indeed, the more the Empire exerts its strength, the worse matters will become. Primals enter this world when mortals call upon them. And mortals are wont to appeal to a higher power when they are desperate. Nothing is more certain to breed desperation in the beast tribes than the Gallians' proposed solution. The true answer lies in a lasting peace. But the Garlians only know war and conquest. Should Eorzea fall into their hands, there will be such suffering as none can imagine. We are not blind to the many challenges that each of your nations face. Yet you must not give in. I remember five years ago when you wagered all for the sake of the realm? Remember what you fought for, what you were willing to die for? Let the memories rekindle the fire in your heart, for Eorzea has need of it again. Come what may. We Scions will never give up the fight. And so I bid you stand with us and together. A great man once said that a shrewd merchant grasps not for the quick profit, but invests in the future. Wise words, eh, Raoban? Sid, I. Your words stir and shame me in equal measure. How could I contemplate surrender? I know full well that all we have, we owe to the sacrifices of those who went before us. Yet the seeming hopelessness of our plight robbed me of my insight. We 
we Gridanians have no love for war. Yet we have still less for those who would threaten our homeland. Ever have we fought to protect those things we hold dear. And this shall never change. Gridania will go to war. We will fight the Empire for the sake of the realm and all who abide here. No, 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 more, no, no, no. One homeland. The thought of losing another had blunted my resolve. But no man knows better than I that if you want aught, you'd best be ready to die for it. With great danger comes the chance for great glory and great profit. We old dons who have turned sand into gold know this well. How many times have we fallen into the pit of despair, only to have you pluck us out? I've Truly, I, I am the hero they need, Nick. You're like as wide as like two of them put together. Reckless. Yep. The lot of you, like bloody pirates. Well, I won't waste my breath trying to talk you round. On account of being a pirate myself. And the pirate who shrinks from a challenge is no pirate at all. <laughs> the pirate who shrinks Those from a challenge a is no pirate must at all. <laughs> it's like, it's just the awkward pauses. Yeah. Let the Garleans come. The united strength of Limsa Lomin. I mean, I assume a lot of this has to do with, like, it was probably the the whole thing they like you know they they sent the voice the the voice actor actress like a, a a a fucking word document with all the lines and they just had like read them off with no context probably <laughs> which i don't think they which i think they still do sometimes which they is do silly we must needs consider how the weapon may be brought to bear against us the Maelstrom will secure strategic points along the coastline. In the meantime, the flames will deploy at... Be at ease, my friends. You have banished our doubts. Pray leave the military matters to us and retire to the waking sands. We will send word anon. Re retire to that place where all your friends were brutally murdered. I'm sure it won't happen again. Ugh. How much longer do you think I have, Nick? Like, a, a couple more hours still, or what? Fucking to, like, the end of it? A, lo a lot more than a couple more hours. Fuck. I'm tired. Like, mind you, like, you're at level 46 quests. Uh, it goes into level 50. You started a day at level 45 quests. I was kinda hoping they would just like go 46, then 50. What? Why would you think you would do that? I was hoping. I think you have. Like, the final, like, section is pretty long, because it's like you, you do, like, a dungeon that's super long, and then you do another dungeon that's super long. Then you have more cutscenes. Uh, and then you have the credits, and then you have more cutscene. Man, that sucks. Because I am tired. 
It depends on how long we play tomorrow. Alright, let me let me go to the Waking Sands, do this, and then that's where we'll end it. I'm, I'm like just... We, what? Yeah, if we play like all like day tomorrow or something, like we start early, oh, we'll have a better chance. That's a nice update. Hey, we replaced all of our dead guards. I wonder if these ones will do better. Well, express my relief to think, Fuck. but the fire in their hearts has been rekindled, and they will fight to the last. This warmth inside, did you feel it too, grandfather? Grandfather, I would know something. Was that your power at work earlier? Nothing of the sort. The leaders of Eorzea had lost their way. I merely helped them to find it again. Oh, hello. Yes, our party returned just a moment ago. How close are you? It's all right, Sid. How close are you? I'm outside the door right now. We must needs plan our next move. Pray continue liaising with your respective nations. Sid, would you be our man in Ulda? I'll be whatever and wherever you need me to be. We haven't a moment to waste. All right, let's do this. Sankrit's fate weighs heavy on my mind. I cannot bear to think of him enthralled to an Asian. Mayhap you know this already, but the Asians are immortal beings without physical form. Since time immemorial, they have banned. Man, can we just like recruit shadows. Jack and just kind of throw they him at the problem? The like, that's basically who you are. <laughs> I'm not as cool as Jack, though. One such crystal may yet be I, I can't, like, grab the, the, you know, fucking uh, Ultima by its head and then slam it into the ground. Yeah. You also don't, like, tell every single villain that's monologuing to shut the fuck up. That is my favorite thing. <laughs> you wish for the pleasant days, but you shall not have it, for I am- I don't give a fuck! Punch Lich in his dumbass face. We all had complete confidence in him. We still- we can still go back to that game at some point and just finish our builds. I do. Nick, when we go back to playing the same set of 15 missions, grinding it out till we get the right things, we will do that when we are out of other things that we want to play. Yeah. We have already played through that game like four or five separate times. We played through it like twice. Three? And the toll taken by to be fair, there are two quests at the end points. if we grind everything out we didn't do. <laughs> the crystal that binds thing and I think there's like a final dungeon like person. thing. If we but yeah, but it'd be grinding. His Asian possessor would be compelled to relinquish control over him. It was really fun out life stealing the final boss though, that was funny. You have proven yeah. the stoutest of allies, standing with us through thick and thin. Yet the most perilous struggle is still to come. For the sake of the realm and Thancred, I ask that you lend us your strength once more. I, I get it. Every single one of you is horrifically <laughs> incompetent. I get it. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart. 
as I am sure <laughs> like Nick, this game would be a lot different if like when you go to fight behemoth you just grab behemoth by the tail and slam him into a wall so hard he exploded yeah service to the scions have prompted folk to make certain comparisons I must confess you do remind me of them. Yet remember this, however glorious the past, it is the hero's lot to be judged on the deeds of the present. A new darkness threatens the realm, and the people cry out for a savior. I believe that you are he, a warrior of light, here in the present, guided by the crystal's will i do have this big fucking crystal who keeps talking to Come me in my dreams friends. let us fight to safeguard the future and it keeps going like days. it's your destiny to save the world or some shit i, I, I tune it out every time i see it <laughs> well it's a final fantasy game so <laughs> fuck we have to do a level up tomorrow when we get on two <laughs> ah see nick we're in 48 now Anyway. Oh, it's 48 now? Neat. Uh, or at least I'm not high enough level to, to do this, so. Oh, I need 49, oh, 49, actually. I need 49, actually. Damn. Wow, it did, did jump. I would have expected it to. <laughs> 46 to 49. I was partially right. There's still a lot of quests left, but. <laughs> no! Okay. Anyway, uh, that'll be it for tonight's stream. Uh, thank you all for coming, and hopefully we'll see you next one. Have a good night, and we'll see you then. Good night, everyone. Have a good one.